What's up? Witches. Hey. <laughs> so. You know what time of year it is. It's the most wonderful time of the year. To creep it real. Mmm. And have a little booze. Mmm. Oh, it's actually going rotten. It's absolutely fantastic. Fantasmic. Hey, y'all. Nethery. How are you? So, we have... Summer. Sanders. What's up, Weech? We have... Oh, thank you, thank you. Hi and hello. This is actually our uh, living room. Yep. Um, the other room is a curse. It's it's a, a curse to bear. You know, so... Um, Tonight's going to be really fun because we brought the boxed wine out. We tipped it, Kathleen. Hey! And so that means we're going to be finishing it off because it is going bad. So we got wine. We've got probably the biggest hurl we've ever done. I mean, like, ever. So it's definitely going to be epic. Okay. Okay. You got a bottle? Okay. Cheers. All right. I'm so here glad we go. that you're here. this thing okay so as you can tell this is one item in the hall we'll get to this later yes hingy it's going to be from all over the place because we got stuff in bags everywhere yeah this is like how long how many months this has been like a three month collective haul so we've we've definitely done some some halloween shopping some of this stuff i had to like pluck out of the house because like it's been like being used and stuff, and I was just like, oh, this What's up, Trinity? Trinity. Hey. So. Trinity. So that we don't bore y'all for too long, we're just gonna go but ahead. But you know and, we're gonna be on here for like three hours. Right. So we're just gonna go ahead and jump in on some of these wonderful items. Wonder. So, let's see. Let's start with our Michaels crafts. Haul. So this was one of the items that I got from Michaels Ooh, this year. Ooh, is that glitter? And she's got glitter in her mouth. Oh, well, that looks good on her. Isn't that look great? And this is foam. Okay. Right. Yes, and so this is like, uh, it's got a little hanger on the back. But you know, we love the vintage style Halloween stuff. Mm -hmm. So this is just like calling to be stuck up in the house somewhere. And this will probably go up in the year-round Halloween bathroom. bathroom. So definitely Ooh, neck. love this one. I think it was $18, but I used the Michael's half-off coupon. Yeah. So, girl, she was cheap. Um, the My other thing, cheap, you? okay, it takes a lot of money to look this cheap. And then this Eat zombie like, too. Yes, this is the second thing that I got from Michaels. It's a ceramic, like, little it's dish. It's on me, too. It's been about a year, hasn't it? Like, I guess, you know, maybe to use for the kitchen or, you know, to put, like, trinkets. Jewelries. You could use it for jewelry, tea. And I love that it's black and white, too. They had an orange one, but I don't have a lot of, like, mostly white Halloween stuff. So, this is in my bathroom currently, and it holds... Like my bobby pins and hair ties and scrunchies and stuff like that. Because I'm like so visco. So like, yeah. And I just love this. This is probably in my top five um, 2019 Halloween produced items. I just love this thing. Oh, I see you so on that girl that's trapped in the mirror. I did. Doesn't she gorgeous? Mm-hmm. Just be um, away from these bugs. I'll start handing stuff to you and you can put it back. All in. right now, Miss Thing. That'll be perfect. Would you cry? Okay, so I'm just trying to fix my scarf here because I kind of tied it crooked. 
There she goes. Okay. It has been a hot minute, hasn't it? it really well, it's has. been a hot minute since we've been live. It's just, it's been, just hot. been hot. Okay, and I'm done. Now, this came from Ross. Cross Dress for Cross Less. Dress for Less. Um, I have been looking for Halloween washcloths to go in my Halloween bathroom for, well, years. And I finally found some. They got the little embroidery on there. Just like the little normal washcloths. Obviously not for use. So, you get Grab like six. Grab one of these, six. you're going to be pulling back a bloody stump. Yes, I put a bomb inside. So if anybody tries to use them, you know. And then, boom! Ross also um, was supposed to allegedly have um, Betsy Johnson bath towels and they had one that was um had like orange and black pumpkins on them could not find those um but i found these instead i got two uh and this is from casafina home collection if you're interested and it's like orange towel it says boo hey boo all over it I think some of these Ow. have witch hats. Yeah, some of them have the witch hat. Not a witch hat! And so I got two of those to hang up in display only. I believe a witch wig lives up in here. I do too. What makes you think so? What makes you think so? Candy! Aren't they cool? Let's have a little drink here. Don't ask me twice. Oh, we can talk more about our Michaels haul. We got these really cool cups. I don't know where you got this one. This one's from Dollar General. Wow. It's just creep it real. It's iridescent. I know you can't tell. We got three. We got a purple, an orange, and a green. And then we got this one. And then there's one down there. Use your feet. I'm going to take you to foot court. Oh, I'm there. And then we got this one. This one says, you say which. Like it's a like bad. Like it's a bad. And we switched the straw in one of these. I don't know which one it was. It was this one. We gave you an orange straw because it had a black straw. No, it had a white straw or oh, something yeah. stupid. Something dumb. So we got Ooh, look this at that. one. It's gunmetal and white. And then the orange pipe and the orange straw. And then this one's just orange glitter. The orange pipe. <laughs> with white and black. And we're having Moscato and Fruity Red Sangria. I'm having the red. Okay. It's good for your feminine health. It really is. <clears throat> now this I got from Joanne's Fabrics to go in the Halloween bathroom. And this says Happy Halloween on it. And it's got the little Stevie fringe. fringies on the bottom. Just thought that was way cute. It's like a dish towel. but Way cool. I use it for like... Um, you know, like a, a hand towel in the bathroom. So she work. Fold gimme, 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 candy. I love it. And I don't remember how much this one was. Oh, about. Uh, let's see. Now, also from Joy. Now, some oh, of the stuff is. We are chokers. I forgot my choker again. Yeah, I don't even. I think mine's in the bathroom. Uh, I don't know. Um, these are also from Joanne's. I wish I had got there before these had sold out. Because uh, you know how they always have like the Halloween jewelry section? Well, I got the one. It's like our. It actually looks really nice. Like you wouldn't know that this is costume jewelry. It's like a gunmetal spider web and it's got diamond slices. And there's a little gold spider on there because y'all know I love spiders. Wake up, Pearl. So I had to have. And then I got this one. It's like um, just a really skinny like crescent moon. It's kind of chic. Really pretty, actually. So I accidentally spilled rose. Yeah, that's Rose. And then, so... Mm, Tissa. I have kind of 
have an obsession with Thai um. beanie boos. I don't know. It's just because I can't resist creepy, cute things. And like, they've got their Halloween collection out right now. So I just had to have. So this one, he's like really, really furry and fuzzy. And if you care what his name is. This is Echo. Not to be confused with Echo the Dolphin. He's so soft and fleshy. And his wings are iridescent purple up to orange glitter. You can't really tell on camera, but it is purple to orange. And he's a little purple nose. So there's him. I know I love the name Echo. And then I got another bat. Um, and this is the TY Flippables. Because so you can flip them off. They have like the little two-way sequins of the, the gold and you can turn it full. Sequins, rhinestones, feathers, baby. And this is the mini version of the bat. And his name is Omen. So this is Bad Omen here. Um, and so you see you can like make him gold or you can make him black. You know, really, really cute. Just teeny tiny. They have full size and small size. And just to keep going with the bat theme, I also got... No, that one is cute. Count. This is their purple bat, okay, and he's got gold wings and he's purple, but in person you can see there's little like fuchsia and blue sparkles, you know, you can kind of see in there. It's super cute. He's really fat. And I got him um, on special at, I don't know if you guys have Gabe's near you, um, but he's slightly imperfect. I don't know if you can tell his face is really crooked. So I got him for like literally. I think that just adds character. Two bucks, and these are like depending on the gift store you go to, these can be like ten bucks. Yes, thank you, Manda. Hey, girl. Yes. Dollar Tree. You know what we'll be getting with that? Those caramel apple yes, suckers. Yes, we will. Yes, we will. Because it's not Halloween until you pull your teeth out on those. Yeah, no, you best smash that like. <laughs> Like for the bear, for the bat. And it, it's it's still going over here. I can't even. Oh, the little moochkin. This is a spider. The moochick. Y'all know how I feel about spiders. This is Cobb. And he's a little Halloween spider. He looks like a heart. And he's got these little fuzzy legs. And he's black, but he has like, actually it's like little rainbow glitters all over him. I love, he is, I saw the full size one, um, somewhere, but I, I really like the tiny ones. He's so cute, and that way I can have more room. Yeah, it does look like a jelly bean, like a little black licorice jelly bean. Oh, I want some of those now. And since we're talking about, mm, spiders. Spiders. I have another flippable here. This one's name is Glint. He's got fangs, you can't really. Yeah, he's got little fangs here in the front. And his legs turn from green to purple. Purple. And his butt, I don't know if you can tell, um, it goes from like a, a translucent orange to an iridescent orange sequin. Oh, you can't, you have to see in person to really get the effect on these because they are just knock your socks off gorgeous and he's so soft you are gorgeous and now okay this is these i probably love too much this is seeds the jack-o-lantern and he's the same two-way orange where it goes iridescent to translucent I wish you could see in person because Brittany will tell you it's very like greeny. Yeah. And like iridescent, all different colors. Oh my god. Oh. Like I, when I got him, I got him from Hallmark. When I got him. I got him from Pick and Shave. I literally oh, sat in the car and looked at it in the sunlight for like, I swear to God, 15 minutes. 
And then, because Alas, I... Alas, poor Yorick. I knew him well. I couldn't help myself. They had a miniature version of Seeds. So, girl, I got the mini. Okay, so there's mini Seeds. Bling. Alright, so that concludes our... T-Y plush haul. Okay. So, gosh, there's still so much. Okay. Let's, okay, well, look at this. This is a um, vintage item from Russ. Do you remember Russ plushes, you guys? you remember Russ plush? Well, this is a old, 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 I don't Ooh, even know. If he has a date or not, I don't think so. Not the eyeballs look. No, oh, it doesn't. But let me just show you. Look how cute. It's vintage. So it's at least 20 years old. It's probably like early 80s, I want to say. And you can tell by the type of stuffing that's in it. Very Thick. firm. Yeah. And gorgeous really good like no stains there's maybe like a little bit of a smudge on his eye but we got this at goodwill for 50 cents the god will so this is like this is the kind of stuff that i like i live for so okay okay so this okay this is from um how many weeks ago was that two weeks yeah, two weeks. Two weeks ago, um, thanks to Patreon subscribers, we were able to go to Indiana um, to Days of the Dead. It was a horror convention. It was a little bit smaller than other years, uh, so we didn't get to really film much because, honestly, there wasn't much to film, uh, but we got a couple of clips, and this was one of the things that we got there. I think they called these... What are these called? The little school flag things? Is it ban Bantaliers? It's a flag. Something like that. But anyway, it's a Camp Crystal Lake flag. I know it's backwards right now for y'all, but in the playback... It's going to be perfect. Hello, Mirror Dimension. Um, and it says... I fix it anyways. Friday the 13th. Yeah, man. So, happy Friday the 13th. Friday, Witches. gay, the 13th. Because this is, um, I always thought 13 was a very lucky number, and we all know why. <laughs> so, this has little ties on it. You can tie it to something. But also, this part right here is hollow, so you can put it on your antenna for your car. So, I think we're probably going to do that. I'm going to go to the drive-in next weekend and let her fly. So... We got this. That they were playing like a little carnival game. Um, pin it. Yep. Is it pinier? Is that how you say it? Pinier, isn't it? Can I get an amen? Is that what it is? Is it pinier or is it? Pinay. Pinay. Whoa. Pin it. Pin it. Okay. Like this is a pendant. But some people say, "Oh my pin it." So, <laughs> Why are you shading Jasmine Masters? <laughs> so, pin it. Hey, but we love this. Um, it was like a little carnival game. Thank you, by the way. Um, Venora. Venora Moon. Moon. So, um, it was like a little carnival game. It was fun. You played it. You won a prize. Um, oh my God. Okay. So I got this from Spirit Halloween, okay, and I fell in love with this witch hat. It's like a black faux suede that has this metallic finish to it, and it says, it's backwards, I know, but it says witch, and the C is a moon. She's so cute, and I love going on little weekend outings and stuff, and just, you know, just cute putting my little hats on and letting my long hair just have her moment so model it bitch hey <laughs> so that's what it is oh this combo 
I guess we could show you this too. My mom got this for me from Dollar Tree. It's a dollar. It's cute. She got me an orange plaid one, but I said I don't wear stuff like that. And I put it in my hair. Just to be just extra to festive. My aesthetic. I'm it. And then I'll show you this. I'll try to take it off so you can see. Um, so I'm sure most of you guys are aware of Kirk's Folly Jewelry because she is a designer of very witchy type jewelry. Oh. And she has this line of moons called the Sea View Moon. And this is a Halloween Sea View Moon. And he is inside of a jack-o'-lantern. <laughs> and it is so gorgeous. And I've coveted um, her jewelry for years. And I finally said, you know what? I need one. You know why? You want to know why? Boots. Love. Pick a wall, boots. And so, um, I put it on here with my little copper leaf, my little lace leaf, and just this little amber quartz thing. Amber quartz. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage, amber quartz. Get on up. Oh! All right, all right. I just gave birth to a pumpkin head. Let's get some heavy sh out of the way. So... Nothing makes your house more fall, more autumn, more Halloween than a good old scented candle bitch. And so this one is from Walmart, or as we call it, Walmart. Hellmart. And this is mold cider. I haven't started burning this one yet, but smell o vision I wish. It's a pretty good one. These are the slightly more expensive of their candles in this kind of size. And I want to say these are the ones that have less artificial fragrance in them. So, hey. So we got that one. What I've been burning is pumpkin spice, obviously. Because pumpkin spice everything. Oh! It smells so good. I want to eat it. Missy Vanessa. And yep, smells like pumpkin spice. Then I got two jar candles. There's one in the bedroom. Didn't bring it out. Um, this one is toasted pecan and cinnamon. Praline. Honey, nothing will make you want a Cinnabon. Oh, it smells just, you know that smell that they pump out of the air vents in Cinnabon? That's this. This is from Ashland, so I think this is Michael's. Oh, it makes me so hungry, bitch. It oh, smells here, like it shit. It's the best. And then my favorite candle so far was from Ross Dress for the Less, and this is Laveau's Mysterious Curiosities Vampire Bat Dark and Mysterious Pumpkin and Peppercorn mystifying orange number two scented candle now after that you should know exactly what it smells like because if you don't well there's no help i mean they give you a description girl they so do. um and on the bottom it says bloom and prosper oh. is the brand so bloom and prosper does these levo candles very cute and I'll tell you, it doesn't smell super pumpkin-y, but out of all of those candles that I've got, I burned this one in the living room, which is, you know, the creepier room. And, um... It's a mood flare. This one, like, the living room will always smell like this. Like, if I go... Where'd you get your glasses? Do something. Where'd I get my glasses? Um, I buy my glasses from... Zenny Optical, that's Z E N N I Optical.com and Wearlight.com. These are Zenny. But this smells up the whole house. Did it smell up the whole house? Mm -hmm. Prison bitch. You just got can. Alright, so now these are some patches that I ordered. From 
Satan's baby. I know y'all be hating on Wish.com. But bitch, when the shit stops getting cheap, I'll stop buying it. I got a Mothman patch. Yes, that's awesome, Summer. I want to see pictures. So there's a embroidered Mothman patch. I think I paid like two bucks for this. <laughs> Then I got this one. It says Cryptology Tracking Society, Mothman, and something I. No, I like my Unibreezy. I can't really read what it says at the bottom, but it's the Silver Bridge and the Mothman. Okay, Super it said cute. Mothman when it was backwards. Maiden Voyage Clothing Company. That's what it is. Yeah. So. Okay. <laughs> Um, cryptology trying oh, okay. This one's Flatwood Monster. Which hey Kentucky. Hey Kentucky Flatwood, so Hi That's our girl. Okay, more stuff from Spirit. I told y'all there was a lot. <laughs> so from Spirit oh, We got a trick or treat Sam magnet. Now I've already got one on my car. When I went, these were stuck together. I think I might have only got charged for one. Oops. Um, so I'm going to send this one to Tonithia Leakes. She knows who she is. Because she loves car magnets and stuff. And then I also got, accidentally, two of these Rocky Horror Picture Shows. Which, to me, really isn't... A Halloween-y thing, but I still love Rocky Horror Picture Show. People, like, really celebrate this during Halloween, but, you know, I think it's all your kind of thing. Yeah, to me it is. But these are at Spirit, and I like stuff that can go on your car that's a magnet, so you could remove it if you need to. So, hey. Just gotta take them off before you go to the car wash. Working at the car wash, bitch. Now, I've got more pins floating around that I didn't grab, but... Um, these are from Wish or AliExpress, and these are two enamel Halloween moons. I thought I would put them on my, my vest. I don't even know if we found my vest or not. Um, no, I don't think I did. Like a little back-to-back. -back. Aren't they cute? So I thought that'd be kind of cute. Maybe on the collar or something. Um, and then... Oh, my tailbone. I thought I would show off some other new pins that I've got. Um, I don't know if you guys have seen, you probably if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen some of these. My Creature from the Black Lagoon. He's right there. He looks like the old Ben Cooper mask. I don't know if you can see it or not. It's so bright. I guess I can dial us down a little. Dial a mug. Oh, that's much better. I don't look like chopped beef now. There, yeah, kind of, sort of. It doesn't like to focus, but... Uh, so I got that one. I got this Point Pleasant Mothman pin. I got this Birth of Venus pin. Which is my favorite. Um, this one's new. It's she on her horse. A vintage she Swift wind. And then... I'll show you my keychains. This is from Etsy. Um, the girl who did this, I'll post it on Instagram and tag her, so if you follow me on Instagram, um, but it is a resin heart, and it's got all kinds of cutesy confetti in there, and it says witch, and there's like a little witch on there, and a pumpkin, and a hat, and it's supposed to look like a big candy corn. It's really, really cute. So this goes on my little purse, and then I've got... Oh. From Party City, I have this little guy on here, and then also from Party City, I have uh, scented um, what a keychain. So when you squeeze this and squish it around, it smells like pumpkin spice. And literally, anytime like I've taken this near somebody, they're like. You smell good. And I'm like, it's my keychain. Would you like to smell it? We had a big question. It says, do you think you'll do your vlogs for the old style videos you used to do? I've watched them. I love your house tours and stuff. 
honestly, probably we want to do some more pre-recorded videos, but things are a little bit slowing right now. So. Time is just not on our side. We're trying our very best. Um, it's really, really hot. I don't go outside when it's hot. Sorry about it. Um, and yeah. Yes. So maybe once it cools down, uh, we really want to do our Witchy 101 videos, but until then, you get lives. Now, just be patient with this. This thing is so trash. I got this from eBay from like Thailand so trash. or something, but it's one of those really pretty pieces of Venetian glass. I know you know what I'm talking about. It's a pretty piece of Venetian glass. It's a moon, okay? Wow. Model the bitch. And it's really sparkly and shimmering and shiny. Oh yeah, there's my Halloween nails. Um, Which everybody's been going crazy about. Ooh, I hate y'all. But y'all see? And it came with this really ratchet silk necklace. I honestly, if y'all want to know why I got this, I didn't get it to wear. I got this um, to hang in my car because <laughs> I love having stuff dangly in my car so I thought I'd put it in my car. I'll probably string it on ribbons or something. Oh yeah, I've got some, definitely got the pumpkin spice creamer. It's the only time of the year I will accept creamer in the coffee. I'll never accept it. Okay, now from The then small you, grease fire. We need to take a drink. Right, doesn't it look like it would go in a car? You see? I couldn't imagine where it. I mean, I guess maybe it'd be cute. Um, maybe a cute cute cake. My mouth is going a little dry here uh, because I have to say a word. I'm not sure I can do it, but last weekend we visited a store, and uh, there now it's fixed. Look at that. We visited a store called Hell, bitch. Christmas tree shops. Oh yeah, that bitch. Christmas tree shops. There, I said it. But girl, they had the Halloween. Okay, so. You didn't have it all out, though. We had to get Halloween pasta. <laughs> we might try to do a dumb supper this year. Live, loud, live. <laughs> It'll be a dumb supper if we cook it. Hey, I'm a good cook, y'all. Y'all know. It's got all the different ones. There's oh, no. spiders, jack-o'-lanterns, bats. Oh, no, we don't do that. Spiders, bats, pumpkins, moons, witches. I'm gonna put some vodka sauce on this. You can have it. And it's gonna be good, or I'll put it in pumpkin soup maybe. Um, so we got that from there. Also from there, I can't wait to do our selling Bond. bonfire. Um, if we get rain. Right. So right now we're under a burn ban. Because we have campfire, pumpkin spice, marshmallows. Marshmallow. You know what? Let's do one. Let's do a bitch. Oh, girl. Oh, girl. Are you ready? No. Oh. Mm. It tastes like orange. Orange cream. I don't taste orange. I they taste, taste like ribbon candy. A little cinnamon. Cinnamon ribbon candy. Huh. Maybe they'll be better warm. Ooh, they're nut free. 
Get those nuts away from my face. Sounds good for me. <laughs> that tastes awful now. Now, this next thing I got for my boyfriend because he is like a popcorn oh, fiend. I don't like marshmallows when they're toasted. Fully blackened. And he, like, any kind of wacky popcorn treat or something, he lives for it. So when I saw this, I had to get it for him. He's yet to crack into it. He says he's going to wait till October. So he can savor it. But it is Mr. pumpkin Short spice caramel popcorn. So, doesn't that look good? So I'm really excited for him to crack into it so I can try it. <laughs> this is my girl shark bread. This I'm my girl macaroon. Alright now. Y'all gonna read me. You're gonna read the eyes out of me. But. So y'all know I love bag charms, right? Lots of charms on my bag. And I actually ordered a Halloween purse from Etsy. And it is caught in customs. So maybe I'll, maybe we'll get to make another video and I'll yeah, show it's it from off. China. Um, it's from England, I want to say. And she told me that it's in customs and that she... She refunded me money. She's been really good about it. Um, but she's actually having another one sent to me. So, hopefully. But, from PetSmart. This is a cat teaser. Um, that's their terms, not mine. And I just thought... I know how to tease a cat. These moons and stars. and little, I'm going to turn them into purse charms. Just the moon, probably not these pieces. So I can give them to my stupid cat. Yeah. And then I just thought, how cute would that she be? She won't touch them. That would actually be cute in the car too, actually, this middle one. And it comes with a little wand. But like, oh my gosh. Oh, we're a great community. Can you just You all are a great community. Like, if you had this hanging on your purse, like how extra? You know, can you imagine walking down a city street? And a cat jumping on you because you've got a catnip keychain. Yes, that's the idea. Okay, we have maybe got through about half, bitch. Half. So. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, thank and you. And this Lily Fay, I believe that said. Thank you, thank you, and hi. Hello. Hello. Got my thank you, thank you. That was Clerk Burke on drums. Okay, now. Alright, so I guess the next thing we'll show. Alright. Get your shirt. Oh, little Reagan. So, on oh, Sunday, we are glass. going to Scare Fest. Might as well bring my little bath over here. And Scare Fest um, is like. A really big horror paranormal convention and there is this oh, I wish we had uh, it's Jay go, go get on your uh, Instagram and see who I sent you the one with Miss Voorhees earlier we'll shout him out because he makes some cool artwork and he has this uh, art line called Final Friends and it's like horror chicks from movies Jay High Art it's J A Y H A I A R T. So J Hi Art. Okay, it looks like that. Well, you get it because it, it ain't. We'll it. we'll repost something of his so y'all can see, but he does these. Let's see if you can see it now. Horror girls that look like the old late seventies, early eighties Barbie logo, and y'all know um, how Barbie used to look, you know, in her her logo where she, it was just like the really like basic image of her and then Barbie underneath well he turns that into horror characters and so we each got one to wear to the convention and I got Lori, Lori. of course this is Lori from Halloween played by none other than Jamie Lee Curtis and you can see there's Jamie Lee 
and there's the pumpkin, and there is Michael back there. She's got her knife. She's all bloody where she took Michael out, honey. And she's got a smile on her face, though. She's got a smile on her face and some blood on her tits. So, hey, girl. Sounds like a good time to me. And then Brittany got... Little Reagan! Linda Blair! Of course, from our one of our all-time favorite films, The Exorcist. I love The Exorcist. So, there's Reagan. I thought the olive t-shirt would be a... Really set off the... Pea soup greenness. That's actually the color I was looking for. And I know it's washed out on here, but she's really pea soup greeny. Let's see if we can get it up close so you can see. There you go. And since then, they've come out with Lydia from Beetlejuice, um, wah, wah. Mrs. Voorhees uh, from Friday the 13th, um, oh, and Nancy from Nightmare on Elm Street. So. Kind of a little obsession collection going on right now because these, honey, you know I love vintage, you know I love Barbie. And a mashup. We're gonna be looking good. Now, you know what Brittany's gonna do to her shirt? Oh, well, gonna... I'm not gonna cut the sleeves out of this one. Really? No. I'm it's gonna too cut, nice. I'm gonna cut this one because it's kind of baggy because they're unisex and I don't do the bagginess. So I'm going to cut her and I'm gonna tie her. Well, the sleeves on this fit my arms really well, and it makes them look very muscular, so I'm not going to do that. I mean, this is a big shirt. I said, damn, okay. I sized up because I figured. Little Reagan went for a spin today. I washed it because it smelled like vinegar. But you check about. him out on Instagram. Always posting new ones. Final Friends. J High Art. Hi, Jai. If you're watching this beach... You could do one of us next. Well, you, but you know, none, none of that for me. The curls, they could do you like Ken. Hell no. Oh, I guess I'll show my first shirt right there. So, at the uh, uh, Whorehound? Which one was it? Days um, of the Dead. Days of the Dead. Dookie of the Dead. Days of the Dead. I got this one. This is Halloween 3, Season of the Witch. So you got the three masks and the big three in the background. Um, this shirt glows in the dark. Does he make a Susie shirt? Susie, I don't think so. Susie. Sarah. Yeah, oh, and that's the other thing I like to do. You cut the neck out, make it an off the shoulder number, wear like a little cute like strappy bra on. girl that's well, what i'm gonna do with this one the other one i'm gonna tie in front well uh on the other shirt oh our other shirts i'm gonna cut the sleeves out of that one remember boobies and uh yeah where is they they're in the kitchen somewhere uh, they're probably on the kitchen table oh God. but it's with the rest of my laundry so good luck <laughs> so how are y'all doing <laughs> See if Brittany can look. It's prob they're probably folded. I want to say, Mama say, Mama saw Kuka. I promise my hair is not always this Did retro. Did you get a beetle goo shirt? No, I've had that. They're probably like folded up. Like they won't be in that basket. They'll probably be covered up too. Cause. <laughs> Yana. Yes, Amanda Welch. We love it. You. Stay tuned, girl. Does it say boobies? No, it says nothing. Are they black? Yeah, both of ours are black. Mine's navy blue, yours is black. Which I hissed at. Okay, so here's. Ooh, you got a storm. You're lucky. I don't think they're hanging on that. I think they were like flat. <laughs> we may have to show them to you when they're on our bodies. <laughs> Ooh, y'all are so lucky. 
You need the scarf, honey? 99 cents. 99 cents, honey. Yeah. 99 cents. Oh my god, I'm in my 20s. Boobies! Yay. If you can just find yours, that's good. What's on yours? The witch. You don't care what she says? Her voice is real, her voice is true. My voice is real, my voice is true. <clears throat> I want to eat her hair. It looks look like pastrami. Now, this I am going to cut the sleeves out of because I want to make it. Very, very, very clear what I'm trying to attract. So these came from the website tturtle.com. Yes. So Brittany's is two ghost bees, and this one's saying boo. So you know what that means? Boo bees. And you know I am very partial to the boo bees. Okay. These boo bees and lots of other boo bees on various other women. Let me put mine on. Now mine, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna cut the neck and the bottom out and I'm just gonna make it into like a little tube top of sleeves. Now this just depends if the sleeves come off of this, if it makes my arms look good. So I wanna wear mine over a dress. I'm getting uncircumcised. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, the sleeves are definitely coming off of that. That and show off my muscles, which is used to attract the ladies. Look at this. Boobies! Show, you want to see mine? I don't think you do. Yes, they are from tturtle.com. See, just doesn't that make me just look so much more? I don't know. Tea turtle. I should have took my tank top off, huh? Well, that's only reserved for special ladies. Not that you all aren't special ladies, it's just the ones that I'm trying yes, to yes, yes. romance. Now this one, I was very disappointed because the shirt that Tea Turtle had that I liked was sold out of my size. And I felt that it was unfair, but I got this one because I wanted one. It's really soft cotton, by the way. Really soft cotton. Yes, Virginia. So mine is this little purple witch bitch. She's very uh, kawaii Japanese. That means super cute in Japanese. And she's oh got my God, I'm in my 20s. Oh my God. And she's got a bunch of ghost pussies around her. So there she goes, honey. You said another one of my favorite words. Isn't she cute? So I'm gonna cut up here and have sleeves, and I'm gonna cut here, and I'm gonna put her over top of one of my little black dresses. You know, I just had to do it to him. Oh my god! I wish I'd never seen that. Yes. So, tturtle.com beach. Where's my small? It says wash cold, wear often. <laughs> I don't know about that. Who wants to do this Q code? Here, yes. scan it with your phone right now. I think the bees do glow in the dark, actually. Mm -hmm. I think. Oh, good. Everybody likes to set our radioactive boobies. Heck yeah. So, there you go, guys. That was it. Just kidding. There's a whole pile. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. So. I love boobies. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Oh, no. What is that? It's that. We'll open this off camera because we ain't opened it yet. So I'll show this later. I can just throw that somewhere. Oh. Boobies. Oh, I could have worn this. Okay, so Kroger has their little Halloween accessories. And y'all know I love a scrunchy bitch. And they had this little Halloween 
scrunchy and it's got the little iridescent ghosts. I know they don't show up as iridescent, but super cute. What's that in Japanese? Uh, kawaii. Oh. Super kawaii. Um, <laughs> so yeah, isn't that cute? Intermission. So yeah, so probably gonna wear that this weekend too, I thought that was super cute. Um, I ain't gonna wear no pants this weekend. Probably shouldn't, as hot as it's gonna be. Now I don't know if you guys have seen, haven't even pulled these out to show Britannica yet, um, so Kroger has a line of home Halloween home stuff uh, from their holiday home collection that is celestial witch themed and girl is covered in all of our symbols including of course the triple goddess moon we all come yes. from the goddess let's go grogering the goddess counts on them so this one is like to sit your teacup or maybe your serving spoon on and it's a little iridescent skull and I don't know if you can see the triple goddess on there and it is very iridescent in person and look it's beveled. You know what I was thinking we could do with that is we could make soul cakes and make a little impression if it were deeper. Yeah if it was deeper we probably could. But I think I'm probably going to like leave this out here in the living room for somebody to use as a coaster or maybe to hold the remote so you always know where the remote's at. So I thought that was really, really cute. But look at that. Triple goddess, y'all. We're making an impact. Yay. The next thing I got from that line I'm taking to work after I show it to you all. And it is a crystal ball um, to set your teacup on, saucer. And it looks like this. Thank you, One, One song, song, for the donation. We're sending that prosperity back to you, girl. And to you as well, Amanda. Yes, Amanda. We will. So, this is very purple, iridescent. You see that swirl in there. You see the eyes at the bottom. You can, like... You could use this as a ring dish, you know, throw your ring on there. You could, like I said, use it like it's intended, like it's a saucer. But I just love this. I love crystal balls. Crystal ball, throw it up against the wall. So, had to have. This one was $5.99. This one was $5.99. Are they on sale yet? They were the week that I got them, but they are not anymore. So don't know and they're selling out very quick um here is the little bowl that also means there's probably more of us than we realize and this is the mystic powers line is what it's called um and it has triple moon and like a hematite kind of color all the way around the bowl oh hematite i forgot about that stuff i love that stuff isn't that pretty it's very subtle very subtle but it's I just thought, you know, even if I don't eat out of these, because I don't necessarily project me using these to eat out of, but like just to have around the house to hold certain that things. That would actually set up there really good with your owl collection. Probably. Like, I mean, this could go so many places. Like, this could go even in my bedroom, like to hold some like... Rings. Rings or hair ties or... Um, like Shrunken all of my heads. lotions and potions, so I can keep my skin not looking 600 years old. Um, Mine's already in the handbag territory, so. But yeah, I, I wish you could see in person because up here the glare, it's hitting it, so it kind of makes it hard. It's it's more visible in person. Yeah, I think more. if we put a different filter on. Yeah. 
Maybe it's just the brightness. You know, I'm not gonna show. But y'all get the picture. It's really, really pretty. I got two of those. Those are $6.99. And then they have four styles of plates. I only purchased two. Um, they had one that was a cauldron with like ethers coming out of it. It was like um, galaxy print coming out, which I thought was tea. And then like witchy hands like doing like this and they were full of that same uh, galaxy ether color. Whoa, 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 she's a witchy woman. But the two that I got, I just thought I would get more use out of. Oh God. This one is a cat, a black cat on the moon. And you can see the moon has that galaxy ether. Kroger really came through. They really did. And it's got the like eye with the thing and the, you know. It's very plasma-like. Uh-huh. So that's that one. Now the next one, this is what's going to mm -hmm. send you all into a tailspin. They ain't ready. They're not ready. I just don't think they're ready. Well, they better be. Look at that. What's grease? Kroger, bitch. Kroger. You can't find. Kroger. Hey, good is. Hello. This was seven ninety nine. I paid. I got a dollar off of these. So, this was $6.99 when I got it, but, oh, and it's got little metallic pieces in there, too. I don't know if you can see them. Bye, Lichen. Bye, girl. Um, so, if you, they also had, like, cauldron mugs, uh, some other really cute serving things. I... Uh, Honestly, did not have the money to spend on these. That's why I just got what I got. Um, I just got what I couldn't live without. Like, only the things that I knew that I would be so upset if I didn't get. So, that's the Kroger haul. Let's go, Kroger. You can always count on. Lich and witch and honey. So. What's grease? What's tea? So much stuff still. It's sickening, actually. Sickening, no? Okay, let's do this. All right. Okay, now these came from the pet section, okay? Don't judge. So, we got these. Brittany's going to wear hers as a bow tie. I'm going to wear mine as a hair bow. These are animal collars. Well, they're... They're things that you attach to the yeah. animals' collars. They're not collars. But there's this one, the orange with the black pumpkins. And there's the orange with the white ghosts. So you can imagine what those are going to look like. I think we'll probably wear these to the Halloween parade, probably. Um, I'm just thinking, like, maybe I'll curl my hair or something and, like, pull it back. And i got to figure out something to put this around my neck with. <laughs> Spirit gummy girl. <laughs> oh, hell no. Yes, aren't they cute? Uh, so these were from TJ Maxx from the pet section, uh, $3.99. We just had to have them. Look. Watch this. Get this one off. Let me show you. Hardy no. Candy. I hope that song gets stuck in your head. The way it got stuck in ours. There. I just wrapped it around my ponytail. Your ponytail. But yeah, isn't that cute? I don't have a ponytail. I have a ponytail. Isn't she cute? I just thought, you know... Oh! Bitch. What do we do with this stuff? The rest of the stuff from Target thought we brought it in. Oh, did we? Okay, good. 
ones. Those headbands are really cute. Okay. Oh, I lost that one witch. She just fell out, I think. So, so probably not with this shirt, but maybe like a black collared shirt. That'd look fetch, wouldn't it, Heather? Yes, Heather. Now we got these. We thought we would put them like in a planter outside. We can buy some mums. But look at these little bit. Oh, bye, Missy. Missy Vanessi. I don't know who that is, but that's you now. Look at these little girls. I think they're precious. They're really, really cute. I guess I'm the one with the glasses. You're the one with the garage doors. Um, I thank you for that. They're really, really cute though, aren't they? They're for like floral. They're mar m Markles? Mickles. My shells. <laughs> Candy! Say it, what is it? Michaels. Michaels. Michaels Crafts. These Michaels were. Craft. Oh, and uh, I didn't get one. But you guys have to go to Michaels. They have a crescent moon um, planter uh, floral pick like this. Uh, and it's a foam crescent moon, and it's silver. It's really, really pretty. Um, these don't have a price. Yeah, so, they do. Oh, yeah, $2. Ooh, $2. That's a steal. And you know what? We got those on sale. So, hey. <laughs> Bye. Love you. So, there's those. I seen them, and I almost died. Now. That's what they look like. Oh, now something's going on. These are also Tell little, um, like, to set your teacups in, um, or ring, everything's a ring dish for me oh, today. buy one song. Buy thank one you song, for your yes. Thank you, thank you. Uh, we appreciate that kind of stuff so much. We sure do. We appreciate everyone, really. We really, really do. Every like, every comment, we might not answer every comment. But, but hey, you know, so, thanks. Um, Tony's getting one of these. Yes, we got one from Miss Tonithia Leakes. Um, we have to take care of Tony. So this is like a little... Saucer. Little saucer with this little vintage scene on it. It's a little bit more vibrant in color in person. Um, these were only 79 cents. It's nice China Beach. It is... Uh, I, <laughs> I'd laugh if you sitting there clicking it with them jail nails. <laughs> Prison bitch. So, I just thought, you know, hey, and so I'm probably going to use mine, I don't know where I'm going to use mine. I think I'm going to take one of them to work, because I got two. Um, probably going to take this one to work, because it's not really my home style. Uh, and to like, can I lotion my, y'all see me lotion my hands, right? When I lotion my hands and I have to take off my ring. Well, I don't eat fried food. <laughs> um, you can put your little ring in it so that's what I'm going to do with the one the other one I'll probably put it in the bathroom by the sink I think I, I'm just kind of scared it'll get broken but so got those then to put out we always make Halloween treat bags for us um, <laughs> like you think we share um, and so we got this it's a little vintage style you have drumming circle in 30 minutes. Well, we wish you well. Happy Friday the 13th. Drum makes too hard for me. And have um, a blessed full moon. And we love you, love you, love you. Heart vibrations. Love you, love you, love you. See, this, this is the heart vibration. Left ventricle, right ventricle. Is this. Okay. Yellow. Red. red. Um, the saucers and this are from... Christmas tree store. <clears throat> I cannot believe you cussed. You will have to link that out. I know. I'm going to have to put money in the swear jar. Um, so it's got the... It's got the big pumpkin here. And... The raven and the trick-or-treat. And the pumpkin again. And a moon. And a black cat. That's so. you right there at trick-or-treat. Honey... What is this? And so we thought, you know, we put our treats in it. Oh my God, what is this? So I'm gonna fill this up. Fill this. the bowl with some chili in it. 
I bait my hook with self pity. Somebody tell me that I'm witty. Fishing for compliments. Take that away, Vanna. Ah! Oh, ah! Oh. Now, I'll go ahead and show these off. Some socks from the devil place that I got that I'm going to wear. You see it? What it says? Christmas tree down here. The devil store. Sorry. But first, Keep we're going to go off with these Target originals. Look at these socks. Look at that. Look at the craftsmanship. Isn't that great? Look at the craftsmanship. And from Hell Place. Um, <clears throat> I got some black cat socks. Christina Miss Tresha. Christina Miss. A share of Tresha. <laughs> <laughs> she gonna love that. Uh, I got the witch on the broomstick. Witches! Witches! Witches on their brooms! And these. Hey, candy corn. Hey, Cornisha corn. <laughs> Cornisha corn, honey. Oh, and I like these. Prison bitch. These remind me of the jack o lantern patch thing that we go to or try to go to. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Used to wear it with open toed sandals. <laughs> that would. Uh, let me get my Birkin socks. I was thinking that. Open toed sandals. After, you know, you invited me to a Melissa Etheridge concert and I got notifications for it every day. Let Stephanie know that you're going to see Melissa Etheridge. My boobs look big, girl. Um, well, they is. Two big pumpkins. Hey. I got those two little pumpkin esque boards going on, as usual. All right. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, we are here. Oh, oh baby. I got batteries, girl. We can light this bitch up. Well, where are they? Hey, okay, you walk on that. Let's see if you can. Put them in your twody. Oh, she twody. And I'll model these new capricia corns. So, I have a, a very harmless... Ah, cheap bastards! I mean, I love Target. Um, You're gonna need three batteries. Oh, okay, I don't know. It says, do not mix old and new batteries. No, baby. Oh, no, I'm just saying that. Ah, oh, relax your mind. Uh, we should be showing this right now. We would get, like, millions of subscribers for this. What do they call this? Peeling? What is it that the kids are so crazy over? Oh, uh, ASMR. No, it's something about peeling stickers and stuff. So. Oh, really? Yeah. They say that what's her face from uh, Oh yeah 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 uh, that she peeled in that uh, what's her name that does the nail polish Oh simply nail logical Yeah I have to fix this I'm pissed Fucking pissed And fucking hit me that fucking battery Pretty much That's the minus okay Trust the minus touch Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bitch. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Faking. <laughs> Here, just give it to me. <laughs> Are you ready? Here, oh. Hang on. We got something cute. Watch it won't work. <laughs> hey, it better right. work. Pull the lever, Crunk. Ah, what is this? So we we hope to use this in our new setup. Oh, and it orange. Oh, yeah. girl, it's because I had to turn around yeah. backwards like a dumbass. But I thought we would use this in our new backdrop whenever we um, have our new setup. So, isn't it cute? See if it'll sell. I don't think it'll go because it's pushed up to the wall. Yeah, look at that. I know it's kind of still bright, but this is orange, the band, and the rest is purple. Isn't that cute? I got a pasty. I got a pasty. Five dollars from Target. You can't beat it. Okay? So, yeah, we'll have to figure out how to light that thing properly so it's not like giving us all this. 
I kind of like it. Do you? Yeah. Let's see what it looks like if we brighten it. It'll look better if you brighten it. Told ya. Kind of drowns her out, but she's still cute. Look at that purple ambiance. So, hey. Um, this one broke, but I'll, I'll, I'll fix it. This one broke. <laughs> this one fucking broke. But it's like a little... It's a witch hat, but you can see she's got like sequins in her and she shakes. And this was a dollar at Target. Put her up on your head. Then this one is little cat ears. Oh, I'm gonna be a kitty. Meow. But I love headbands with ears. I'm like the Katrina Kaboom of the witch community. Now she's gonna come for you. I hope she does, because I would love if she knew I existed. Katrina girl, send me a Kermit. Damn, they put that shit on there. Um, so this one is a kitty. I'm sorry, I'm weird about the stickers. But it's got the little plastic kitty ears. And if you oh like- Oh my god, I just opened my third eye. See, they get the little confetti in there so you can like, like that. You can use it to push. I use these like at night when I'm putting on all my lotions and potions to push my hair back. So, I got that one. Got one more. Because these are only a dollar, so I just felt like ugh, you have to. And these are, these are bat wings. Ooh, it looks cool right there. Oh, bitch. So, I got bat wings. <laughs> Love those. Nailed it. Okay. This one, um, I, this is a replacement for one that I lost years ago. Oh, These are literally pipe cleaners. Wow. Okay. This is like uh, from Target. It's Halloween department. Um, and it's a little spider. Y'all know I love spiders, so I get this to go in my car, you know, just to show a little Halloween spirit, if you will. So there he is. It's Boris the spider. And then, my lord, this is a long haul. Yeah, bitch, it is. Y'all think. I have a problem. Uh, you are correct. All right, this is a new brand of plushies. Yes, I have a new thing for plushies. I don't know why. I'm not a plushie. Or what is it? A furry. But. Oh, I hope not. Y'all know. Um, these are Squishmallows. So soft to cuddle and squeeze by Kelly Toys. And they're supposed to feel like marshmallows. And they really, really do. So I got the little witch. I got a little witch. Oh, so cute. And she's got a little witch hat. She's so squishy and she's so freaking oh, soft. Oh, chronic. Like, oh. Mm. And I, I've seen on Instagram, uh, what's the, what's the website or what's the store? Walgreens has Squishmallows this year, the Halloween ones. And they are pillow size. So just imagine her this size. I mean. Russ and Barry Company. I mean, I was just like, really? Like, Russ. I really want a big one so that I can lay on her. She's so Barry. cute. Anyway. Moving on. Trying to save the best stuff for last. Oh, I guess I'll show you guys this. Um, no! You cram. Item number, look up. Yes! We're gonna figure oh. out when this thing is made. So, a couple, it was probably last month, I wanna say, I'm not sure. Um, but me and my boyfriend went to a street fair in Louisville, Kentucky. 
Um, it was really, really hot, and girl was not having it that good day, but um, there was a booth of a very witchy fellow there um, and his wife, and they had um, naturally sourced animal parts and skulls, so if you're part squeamish, wrong channel, bitch. So here he is. Look at this little stag skull. Look how cute. Isn't it adorable? I kind of want to make a headpiece like it be, what is her name, Scatcheth from uh, American Horror Story. But so freaking cute. And I'm not even going to bother to tell you all how mother and cheap this bitch was. I want to say, oh, it says when he, uh, oh, oh, when, and, and what, I don't know. But anyway. That's a gold, ain't it? He, uh, I think it's a stag. You can throw it. It's a baby. Um, but this died all the way back in 04. He writes the dates on them. And um, they bury them and like let the earth do the thing and he digs them up. So really, really cool. This was $8. He had possums and raccoons and coyotes and um, more deers. I can't. There was other things, but like I don't have any little deers with little horns, so I was just like, so, yeah, I loved it. Well, it's still got some little furries on there. But hey, you're arachnophobic? Well, I am the exact opposite of arachnophobic. Me too. I live for spiders. Every say blonde blonde woman does. I like snakes. Poor dumb When's she gonna tell him that she smells like spiders too? Um, baby, you just got back from prison and it's Satan's baby. Prison. I can't look it up. You would think that a company like Russ and Berry would have an item number look up. Okay. 1171. Alright. Bitch. We got a couple more little bags and then we're done. Okay. So, do we have their info on the skull piece? Um, no, he does not sell online. I asked. Uh, he doesn't sell online. He only sells at shows. And um, he does have an Instagram, um, but it's just to post what shows that he's going to. And he um, travels in the Kentucky, Ohio, Indiana area. So, if y'all are interested, hit me up on the Sable and Blonde Instagram and I can let you know what his name is um but he was really nice um you know he basically said like you know oh you know you don't you don't need to like you know put my name in a video please or anything like that because I don't want people to think you know um anything you know like trying to make money off of you know dead animals or anything he was just like you know these are literally just, you know, found animals that, you know, we pick them up and, you know, care for their body and, you know, put them in the ground. And so, you know, huh? Vulture culture. Yeah, vulture culture. So next we have sprinkles, this little guy, Sprinkles. You can put him back there behind us. He's a little cutesy. I love Halloween dolls. I love the dolls. One of the most oh, legendary, yeah. legendary dolls. And then we got his friend who's wearing. Did we get this at the devil store? We did. And they only had like two of these, so uh. I'm glad that I got them. Um, so I love a Halloween doll. So there's Harold and Maude, and they look cute. See what else we got. 
I honestly don't remember. Oh. Why did I put so much? Alright, so this is also another little Sawin y piece. Sawi, Sawa! Pull that little plug out. Gypsy. Gypsy plug! Gypsy plug! Thank you all for staying. I know this is long and tedious. I appreciate it. Isn't it cute? I don't really feature the like rainbow light up stuff for Halloween, but you know, it is what it is. But it's really cute. A uh, little jack o' lantern. Tangerine boys. Yeah, bitch. The healthy back store. All right. I'm going to show you a flower arrangement that I did. Oh. All right. Oh, you're loving this, Nethery. Good. So I put this flower arrangement together in an item that I got from TJ Maxx. The lights came from, I got little pumpkin lights in here just to illuminate the ditch. <laughs> and the lights, I'm sorry y'all, the lights came from. The lights, the lights, the lights, the lights, the lights, the lights, the lights. Um, Dollar General. For a dollar, I will tell you. All right. I'll put it back together now. This is a Martha Stewart. So here it is. This is my little wooden pumpkin. It's a wooden carved pumpkin bowl. Turned. And see it's got the little silver hardware. And I put the lights down on the inside and I put the flowers up top. And so this is going to be the centerpiece for my table once we get decorated. Um, which if you guys would like to see us decorate for Samhain, we may try to do that tomorrow. So let us know if you'd like to see that on a video. So there it is. We're Isn't gonna take some melanin tonight then. Melatonin and norepinephrine. Jack so. Hey. If y'all wanna see it, we'll do it now. We did it. We, we did it. What two? You no, know, we did it last year. Yeah, we did it last year. Um, and this year we'll, we could do the same thing. Um, yeah, that'd be kind of fun. Yes, girl. There's still more. I know you're ready. All right, we got one bag left. Get a little sip. So y'all know we love going vintage shopping so oh by the way my shirt came from target it's got little pumpkins on it Nothing yeah it's so true so i forget what these are called the like little melt together thingies sense the risk plastic but y'all know what these are y'all have seen these but only on regrets. These are like becoming really popular again with like the vintage collector community. It kind of looks like melted crayons. Um, but I picked this one up. It's the black cat and the crescent moon. There was another one there too, but we decided against it. Very expensive on that one. Very expensive. They had several of those, but they were a little bit. I think we paid 15 for this one. Not the worst. I thought it was like six. Mm -mm. Well, I paid for this bitch. Because I know, because I've been looking at some of these online, at some of the online sellers, and these are going for like 50 bucks now. And I was like, oh. and I know I can get one cheaper around here, but whoa. So, got that one. It doesn't it match the wall. So, hopefully, we'll hang that up somewhere cute. All right. We Next. did find a lot of really cool blow molds. Lots of blow molds. Hope you follow me on Instagram because I posted all of them. Uh, so many that we wanted but we didn't get. Um, Especially the one thing that was not for sale. Right. Um, Why would you set something up and not have it for sale? Right. 
So, I don't know if you all remember in a haul, this has been like a long time ago, I showed you a Halloween air freshener of a owl. It's sitting over there next to my receipt, but I'm not sure for it. And they're wax, and they, you remember those wax air fresheners that used to look like a figurine and you would sit them in your house and they would smell like 70s, 80s, early 90s, and then after that you just never saw them again? Well... Think about that, paying 30 cents for that. Oh, it's a 30 cent coupon. Oh. Um, but listen, found one of these bitches in the box. Never Oh, Same brand, because I looked up mine. It's the same brand that makes mine. And it's a witch. Well, they call her a wizard. But, oh, it's wizard is the brand. Yes, Duh. honey. Okay, makes sense. Like she's not a wizard, but okay. Um, wizard air freshener. Um, and see how cute she is. Oh my god. Like this, I'm never taking this out of the box. Curry! Curry! What the beach. So. How cool is that? I mean, probably one of the best vintage Halloween finds. That was cheap. Ever. This, the, I think this was six. I think this is what we paid six for. I'm pretty sure I paid eight for the one out of the box. I think the vintage stuff that we find is my favorite. It is to me too. Now this other stuff is fun and you can't resist it, but this is... This is the stuff you just can't resist. Um, don't remember what this is in there. Oh, yes, I do. Yes, I do. So, this isn't necessarily Halloween, but I'll know I collect oddities. And so, this is a medical student um, reproduction of. See? It's got all the little ventricles. And the areolas. But oh my gosh. Are you dead for this? Like, how cool. They had brain. They had this brain. And let me just tell you, girl, this was only $10. Nine. It was nine. But like this stuff like this you don't find for that kind of a price and I was just like even though I wasn't trying to shop for this kind of stuff I said prison bitch prison bitch does it open actually? I don't know but probably um oh yeah she opened does it open? ooh oh it's got clogged arteries <laughs> it really does <laughs> look at this isn't that cool? It was a steal, and if I wasn't paying off thousands of dollars worth of medical bills right now, yes, that's right, thousands, um, I would have bought more. I really would have, because you just never for that price. Oh, God. Um, and my heart will go on. The last piece of vintage, the last piece of anything that we have is this really cute pair of Zenny Opticals Halloween party favor sunglasses bitch two big pumpkins prison bitch so these were like a dollar get out to a library quad <laughs> These were like a dollar twenty. They were still in the little baggie. I guess that wasn't from the original packaging, but oh, that's right. Some of them came in the original baggie, and they were three. And these were a dollar twenty because they were out. So had to. So that's it. 
As um, if her little belt looks like an onk. Onk, onk, onk. Oh, girl, these pumpkins today. Um, so. <laughs> the brain was really cool. They, I, I don't. I want to say they had a. They had like skeleton. Skeleton parts. I want to say they might have had lungs, but. I know. But that place is really cool and I'm definitely going back and there was lots of nerdy stuff there so I'll probably take my boyfriend back. Shortbread and, macaroni. And he'll probably buy me some of those. So we'll see. Oh, but should we remind people of this? Because we never talked about it. Oh yeah, sure. Because you know we haven't heard it in like 30 minutes. So me and Brittany saw this and fell in love with it at Target and I was like homesick for it, homesick, whatever, for like a week wanting this little guy from Target. And um, I posted it on Instagram and Carrie, you would want that. <laughs> the boyfriend saw this and he was like, that's really, really cute. And I was like, I love it so much. I wish I had it, blah, 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 blah. And then so we were going out to dinner on Sunday and he was like, oh, I need to go to Target. And I was like, for what? And he was like, I need to buy headphones, you know, or something. And I was like, okay. And so we went to Target and he was like, let's go buy your talking plant. And I was like, So, he bought this, and I was just like, are you sure it's so expensive? It was $35. He was like, yeah, it's really cool. So, if we could, you know, leave that out all year, I was like, done. Um, but, so you know now. think it's worth $35 just because like this has literally been stuck in our heads for like what three weeks now has it been three weeks no it's just been a week oh really yeah wow we're in a time loop I know we are but I don't feel a trick or treaty they say in prison bitch prison bitch so had to had to had to have and that my dears it's a mess it's a mess almost two hours girl what do we have to show for it oh a wrecked tailbone no, we can always go have some more cherry flip. What? We're in prison. Prison, bitch. So, I hope y'all enjoyed it. I know y'all love hurls. Oh, oh, my God. My tailbone. Uh, oh, that y'all love the hurls. Um, honey, I love to hurl. But this was like three months worth of hurl we really don't chop that much no we really don't and like yeah <laughs> this is the only sure. time of year that i go all out like this the only anything else i ever buy is only clothes so only clothes <laughs> oh, my closet's overflowing <laughs> but pretty soon we will be going up to our Halloween stomping grounds and probably doing some more vintage 
shopping. So I love looking at all that creepy stuff. Because me too. Let me tell you something. I find some weird stuff. Disembodied heads. That's me, girl. I'm a disembodied head right now. Trey didn't like the session, so he had gutted me and set me on fire. But I didn't, didn't die. die. I crystallized. Now I'm a glamorous bitch ready for the wrong way. So what you're saying is you had a costume, but you had to make it work. Right. right. <laughs> <coughs> so hey. We all come from the good Oh Lord. And two hats. See, she's been to the Stevie Nicks School of Witchcraft. Yeah, spin bitch. Oh my lord. Goddess do, on do, high. Do, 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 do. You've been watching Friday the 13th all day. I'm Lucky. jealous. Have you got to see Jason Takes Manhattan yet? Ooh. Because I really feel like kicking over a boombox right now. That's a good one. Um... I have been watching my man play the Friday the 13th video game uh, for, I don't know what platform he plays on, but anyway, he bought it just for me to watch him play, because I'm not sure if I can figure out how to play it, because I, I don't... I don't yeah, know we're I, still stuck in like the 80s and the 90s. The 80s with the old, any, but it look, it's so much fun. <laughs> We've been watching... Um, it's hilarious and like it's so funny just to like when you get to play Jason and you're just like hunting a bitch down you know I will hunt you down and you just like pop up out of nowhere and just like hack the crap out of them but yeah it's fun we can talk, talk to him about Bazooki yeah so have y'all seen <laughs> um, it's so much fun Curry you would like it it's so, so much fun. It's a little buggy, but like, okay, whatever. Um, hey, you never seen nothing until you've seen the NES or a okay. Genesis glitch. <laughs> um, or not even have the cartridge work, so. We watched this docu-series called The Devil You Know. Oh, girl, you need to hold your broom because otherwise it looks like you are really excited. Oh, boy. Um, and it's from, uh, it came on Viceland, but, um, the show is actually posted on really here on YouTube, so you guys have to go check it out here on YouTube. It's called The Devil You Know, and it's about this man who was like a crazy lunatic, lunatic wannabe Satanist serial killer. Wait for it. Named Pazuki Alderod. And we was like. Bitch. Okay. He like took a Dremel tool and like filed his teeth down to points so that he could eat animals. And you know what? This is in recent years. Oh yeah, it's recent. Like it's we never heard about this. From Salem, North Carolina. It was happening in North Carolina when I lived in North Carolina. I could not believe it. The wrong room shenanigans. He named himself that. It's um I think his real name was like John John Lawson or something. Yeah, I think that was it. And it was just like Oh wait, but th that's the name that we gave him, Pazuki. What was the real name? Pazuzu. Cause... Pazuzu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's allegedly... The demon from the exorcist. And people were terrified of this little idiot. Yeah. It was like... You know wow. me, I would have chased him down the street with a chainsaw and We would have been like, him. you want to see a wicked bitch? Oh, you want to see wicked? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We could have scared I, him. I mean, to me, that just shows you how inept people really are and how debilitating fear can be. So stupid. And they said that it, he was so effective in this town in Salem, uh, 
Winston, Winston Salem, yeah, uh, North Carolina, because it's such a religious town, and, people and how don't. much power they give the devil. You know, oh, it's so scary. And I'm like, girl, honey, we could have sneezed on him, and he would have shit his pants. Honey, if he had just experienced a fractal, <laughs> what goes on in this house? Of the real witching that goes on, honey, shit would doors. have been changing his pampers. Okay. I wouldn't. I could. <laughs> you just pop a squat in the corner and a dog and eat it. Yeah. They, oh, God. Y'all just have to watch it. And it's on YouTube. It's like six parts. Right. It was there, we literally sat there for like fucking six hours or some shit. Because each one was like 45 minutes long. And they, they spent too much time talking about the man that researched him anyways. And he did something that he manifested. Yeah. He was so obsessed with Pazuki that um, his kids started acting like Pazuki. It's called The Devil You Know. The and Devil You I Know. I think the the company that made it or whatever is called is Chudzy. You know, like cannibalistic yeah. humanoid underground dweller Chud. But Chudzy. Chudzy. Like with the S Y, I think it was. S E Y. But you'll see like the thumbnails, like this really white wannabe looking scary dude with like making this face you know the trying to be scary with his dreadlocks I said let me get that a was little... enough to um scare me um let me just break your... a keen switch out of the tree in the front yard and whip you all over the street we'll see how pazuki you are after that <laughs> I'll peel the hide back, son. So stupid, but like... And the police had a great big role in this because they wouldn't yeah, do anything about it. Yeah, it just kind of stay... Oh, you, I don't want to ruin it for y'all, but you yeah. got to watch it. you got to watch it. It's really good. It's very Gypsy Rose-esque with the Which, like, that's the kind of train blue. wreck that I'm here for is Gypsy Rose Blanche Fart train wreck. <laughs> yeah. Like, I'm waiting for the day that she's released on parole and she gets a YouTube channel and she starts doing makeup tutorials. I just remembered. Where is it? Ah! I have more stuff to haul. I have 75 cents. That's how much I have left after all this. I hope I didn't lose them badge prison. That'd be crazy if that was them right there like, glistening at me. I got two more pins that I really wanted to show you guys. Do you want a what's in my bag video, bitch? <gasps> no. Um, tell them, what was the name of that restaurant we went to? Aspen. Aspen Grill. Bitch. Prison. Don't go to Aspen Grill. Or at least not go to that one. That was like... Putrid. That Gasly. was the blandest food I've ever eaten. Oh, there's my... Oh. Yeah, I got more stuff to show you. I've been looking for that. It was, that restaurant was so cute from the outside, I spied it, I was like, oh, look, Aspen Bar and Grill, let's go there. Never again. Wretched, rejected, bland food. Oh, here they are. Alright, Gypsy Rose Blanche Fart. <laughs> Ooh, that was done. Well, that was done. Why do I have two hand sanitizers in here? Well, I'm sure one of them's going to be used to spray me soon, so. You manifested it. <laughs> Gypsy Rose Blanche Bar. Oh, that smells so good. All right. Okay, I'll show you these, and then we're going to switch ourselves out. Why? We are going to try to um, film a video for Patreon tonight. Um, tonight? On spellcrafting. It should be, like, fairly easy, so... These are vintage Bestel. Um, if you guys don't know, this is Bestel. These like paper designs. Um, these are vintage, like oh, yes. from the 80s. Bestel 
Halloween enamel pins. They're so old that they were brand new, still on the display. I might have spent a little more than I should have for these, but I had to have them. And then I got this little skeleton one. I don't know if you'll be able to see him or not. He's right there. And I got another pumpkin. I still have other ones coming in the mail that aren't here yet. Oh, my God. in there. Have you checked your mail today? Nope. I'm going to go do it. If you want to. So there is another pumpkin. And then from Claire's, I got these. Oh, I got a lobotomy at Claire's. Halloween hair clips. Okay. Oh. Am I so visco right now or what? So, love those. Had to have. Y'all know my we oh, bitch. My weakness is Bestel Halloween. So. Was I gonna show? Oh yeah, and I got an Edgar Allan Poe enamel pin too. Um, I got it in the mail and I haven't taken it out of the package. Oh, and I got this death moth in, uh, embroidered patch. I'm doing a Halloween jacket, so. Here's my little Edgar. Oh, y'all know Edgar is my, he's my boo. Don't tell my man, but. See, he's got his ravens and he says, nevermore. Poe, Poe, look. Stevie Nicks and Edgar Allan Poe. If I can invite any two people to dinner. And I would probably just sit there and listen to them talk. Because yeah, I also did. Was there a package? There was two packages. Really? Honey, this is my girl shortbread. I'm macaroon. This is my girl, shortbread. I'm macaroon. These are from Klarna. I'm just I, I love, love to shop the Klarna. Ooh, all these good stuff. Shit. I wonder if they got any. Oh boy. I don't know which one of those I am. They got Baby Shark, the game. I'm looking to see if they have what is it called? The oh, this is yours, bitch. Oh, is it my noodle? That's right. That's your nude, bitch. Noodles. I got a snake pin. This I got might a be snake. one of yours, too. I don't know. I got a snake pin. I can't wait to pick that up. <laughs> Look at my baby. Oh, this is my baby. Okay, you can't see it. I know. It's a snoodle. It's an enamel snake. It's like tilted down. A little blue snake. <laughs> yep, this is yours too. This is Brittany time. This is not the hat that it's going to be on. <laughs> <but. laughs> Some more of my favorite things. Ah! I'm drank. I'll put you on my hat for safekeeping. There. Perfect. That's you right. Show on. Oh, I haven't been on the package yet. It show. says on this grow a pair and it's referring to ovaries. Because you know, we all know. Ovaries are the strongest. Hey. Hey, hey. Uterus! Oh my god, it's got a third eye. It's a gentle uterus. 
This doesn't look like a general uterus to me, but sure. <laughs> look. It's, it's a little ute. Uterus, fallopian tubes, and some ovaries, and it says grow a pair on it. <laughs> That's going to go on my hat that has the lesbian liberation patch on it. Because we all know I am. The other is a wow. <laughs> Prison bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. I love it. Look at that. Ah, oh, the power of the universe. Prison bitch. Okay, yeah, yeah. Alright. So That was it. That was it. Thank you guys so so much for tuning in today. Um we hope you have so so much fun. We're gonna try our very best to um, come back next week. I've got like three video ideas in mind. Nice and shiny. Um, Everybody likes a shiny uterus. I know, I, I kind of caught a glimpse up there of somebody mentioning something about Stevie Nicks. I have a, two Stevie Nicks songs that I want to decode for you all and tell you all what they're really about. I have a kanka. So I thought that would make a, just a fun, quick video. Um, so we'll try to come back and do something like that um but yeah yeah there it's two that just kind of hit me out of nowhere and I was just like oh that's what she's talking about duh like you know songs that you've heard like a thousand times think about it think about it before you go so hey Whatever could she mean by that? We'll find out next time on Long Boobs. Prison boobs. When will we still be doing the Zodiac videos? Yeah, we kind of fell off the map. <laughs> next week. See, that's what you get. Um, for next is Cancer, then Leo. We're going to do them. Probably after Samhain, because after Samhain's over... It's just like a vacant hole. It's just kind of like, okay, we can go inside now and, and live. Of course, right now I'm inside, because I, I don't... I will say that I am reading a very interesting book by one Miss Vicki Noble okay. about the double goddess. And Not it the double is... goddess. Oh yeah, honey, let me tell you. She double dare. She double dare. She double down in this stuff, and it she is. She double dutch. Yes, she do, and it is delicious. What I kind of tea that. she be spilling? You may have recognized her art on the Mother Piece Tarot deck. That's their round cards. So, I'm enjoying it. I picked it up and started reading it, and put it down, and I just picked it up the other day. And write a whole chapter on the Labrys, and let me tell you something. She, she spilleth the tea. Maria so. Gambutis is proud. Hey. <laughs> you can follow her on Instagram. You can follow my ass on Twitter. You can find me at Jesus My Name. <laughs> all right so bye y'all we will see y'all very soon if y'all are patreons we're gonna film a video for y'all tonight and it that's will, your exclusive it's your monthly bonus video and it will be um a spell crafting video about, about how any, to get titties into your life. Oh, I wish. It'd be about <laughs> I wish um, using hair in witchcraft. Okay. So if y'all are a Patreon, you will have that to look forward to tomorrow. We're going to film it tonight and it will go up tomorrow. So we will see you guys so soon. Well, probably like a week. But <laughs> I mean, if we get enough demand for us to decorate, oh, yeah, that's right. If you guys want to see us decorate for Samhain, I've just thought of some place we need to go the place that's like Suzanne.
What season are we in? Sal Joanna. Oh, oh um, by the way, this, um, you know this little antique store that opened up down there next to the dry cleaner? Or like junk store or whatever? Mm -hmm. They have Halloween stuff in the window. Perfect. If y'all want to see it there, okay, well if y'all want to see the decorating, we will do that. Um, we'll probably go live somewhere between like 1 and I want to say like, probably like 1. And we'll, it'll probably if it's take too us hot, I ain't hauling that sheet in here. It's going to be hot, girl. It's going to be 90 degrees. But we only need like maybe like two buckets to start with. So it's not really in space for much. Clearly. So y'all want the decorate, so we will we'll do it. And see if you make it this far into the live, you will know. That we're coming. Cause y'all know we don't post notifications anymore because y'all find us anyway. <laughs> so so I hey. You'll find me. You'll find me. I'm on your pillow. Prepare early, avoid the heat, okay. So, we will definitely see you all tomorrow then. Um, Patreon, you'll see us twice tomorrow. Lucky you. <laughs> you know, so, I don't even get to see myself twice. I see myself all day long, honey. Catch me in that mirror. For those of you that got to witness what I've done to my cat, were you proud of me? Because I was. I had so much energy earlier. And now it's in the bottom of a wine glass. <laughs> yes, it is. Think about it, Beach. And guess what? When I go back, I'm going to put that stupid thing right back in that shirt. Because she needs to wear it. Because she needs to get in the sound and spirit. She's my familiar. And she needs to get with it. Yeah, Bella told him, honey, you better hit the bell so you know. That you cat, better ask somebody. Carrie, that cat hates everything. Y'all better ask somebody. She's always angry. So hit the bell, hit the like on your way out. Let's hit at least 13 for Friday the 13th and the goddess. Can I get a hail goddess? <laughs> Carrie... I don't think you understand that cat. She hates everything. She hates everything. Hail goddess, all right now. Hey, 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 ha, ha. I feel the goddess within me. So, hey, yes, we love the like, like, likes. Love it, love it, love it. So, we I want to thank you. For stepping out on me, bitch. <laughs> Taking you to the foot court. So, bye. Unpleasant dreams. dreams. That's in rain. Oh, you know what I want? Bacon jalapeno fries. Pazookies. There we go.